so I want to show you a mag light with an LED bulb in it and a tight beam which looks like this I can widen the beam like that oh we got lightning tonight and then it looks like that why did I choose the mag light first and not the little big eeky squeaky one? Because I think that one is more, this one is the weakest. Okay, Costco, three flashlights for $18. It's pretty much the same. A little brighter than, than the mag light LED module. This is 150 lumen versus 114, I believe. Oh, we got the even brighter mode. I forgot that. Yeah, we see that. Oh, see my infrared little lamp? It's starting to rain. Gotta hurry up. So here we got the P7. Pretty bright. Somewhat good throw. Oh, here comes the rain. And we got the XML. Pretty good light. Even better throw. Okay, here's my new Mac light. XML. Excellent throw. It's even more powerful than the little XML. It's it probably got a little more power to it. Driven by six D cells. Very nice. I'm very happy with the result. It has memory mode, so it can go through all these different modes. little difficult hitting it on the switch. There we go, full power again. Alright, decent throw, you can't see it up on the camera. You can see those trees at least. And now it's really rainy, but here comes 3000 lumens. And you see the three trees? Well, at least you can see the yard. You can see that tree. You can see that tree. You can see everything. 